Demon Slayers. Ah, uh, IGN. They did it again. They, they, they. They did it again. For for sure, they 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 did it again. Oh my god. All right, let's go ahead and. Um, if you want to see this video on your own, I will leave the description, the link right here in the description. Watch it if you want, but if you want to watch it before you watch this, I'm going to tear down this whole video. I'm going to rip it to shreds against IGN. They're really ignorant. IGN. Ignorance. Ignorant. Alright, so let's go ahead and start it. Why don't we talk about yeah. that right now? Oh, I think you're referring to Kingdom Rage Hearts. Both of you. I yes, oh, I thought you were going to say a number afterwards. I didn't realize that was just the name <laughs> no, of the game. The first Kingdom Hearts <laughs> was released Kingdom Hearts. in 2002. Yeah. No, the numbers didn't start until later. Yeah. Yeah, 358 divided by two days or... 358 over two days, motherfucker. 358 over two days. I got it right there. 358 over two days. Not 358 divided by two days. That's... Oh. Okay. Wow. So why? Yeah. Can someone explain that to me? I never, I never understood. 2.8? No. It's coming out. Re releases. Nobody yeah, can explain. Um, I'm sure Ryan Clements has a long wind. Yeah. <laughs> so he will talk forever uh, about that. But yeah, not those here. games. Uh, <clears throat> Yeah, they've. Uh, it, it's one of those things that should has no business working. Yeah, like the idea like... of hey, let's mix uh, squares, a JRPG, uh, crazy Final Fantasy characters with these classic Disney characters in Disney World. But let's add this new story that involves like your heart having an actual like personification. The heart does not have a personification in the game. It has nothing. The heart has nothing to do with the personification in the game, as far as I'm concerned. I've played the game, and all of them, most of them, to this day. It is a story that you have to play 1 to 2.8, or 3, 3D Dream Job Distance, since 2.8 is not out yet, and won't be out for about a day or two. Like, not a day or two. I mean, like a year or two. Because we still haven't got Unchained Key over here. So, we can't play that one yet. And... The... I just... How does the heart have a personification? It is a story telling... About this about Master Xehanort wanting to take, make Kingdom Hearts the deity, the thing, it's a big door. The, the world of all worlds, Kingdom Hearts, he's wanting to bring that to, it. he's wanting to bring that to life by breaking another Keyblade War. I don't see where you get heart having a personification. And this Weird. darkness and like, yeah, no, no, it's fine. Just throw it all in, we'll we'll make it work. <laughs> yeah, and it does and, it did. <laughs> and I don't know how it works. Um people love it. But it You don't know how it works because you don't play it. It's just that simple. You guys don't know really anything about Kingdom Hearts. You guys trashed Roxas saying he was a garbage character when he was needed for the story and you have to play his part in the game to get the whole story. 
introduced uh, you know Sora, Riku, and Kairi as these three characters that people have you know become obsessed with over the past decade, and then but made Mickey Mouse like a badass, <laughs> and like not something I'd ever expected. No, to see. it made you want to hang out with Donald and Goofy, and then all of a sudden you're going to these Nightmare Before Christmas levels and this, this, all of these rad worlds, but then you're fighting the Coliseum against Sephiroth and Clouds there. Yeah, and he's it's got like a bat wing for some reason. Like everything is connected. It's fine. And to be fair, I've always wanted to hang out with Goofy, not so much Donald Duck. Why? Because he doesn't wear pants. You seem like kind of guy. No, he just pants. he seems to get angry way too much. Yeah, yeah. He seems really angry. Yeah, very easily <laughs> upset. I mean. Go I wouldn't want to hang out with Donald because he doesn't heal you. He just lay back. <laughs> it also uh, you know, gave us the Keyblade, the which key has become like yeah. an iconic weapon yep. in yeah. video games. And there's so many. The Keyblade is only a fucking weapon in Kingdom Hearts. I don't see a fucking Keyblade in Legend of Zelda, Final Fantasy, any other sword game out there. It's not on any other fighting game but fucking Kingdom Hearts. Variations, yeah. You always love the original. Oh no, absolutely this OG. And it was like, I mean, it got in really good. Um, yeah, I mean, good voice actors like Haley well, Osment. They, had, they well. have a lot of the original, like the actual uh, voice actors for the Disney characters. For, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, and yeah, I mean, it's interesting when you look like you're looking at the key art of, of Kingdom Hearts One, and, and Sora does look very like young and childish. And as that series has grown, like it has gotten to sort of you know, as the fans have obviously gotten ten years older. Right, um, right there. He didn't know where he was going with his fucking sentence. He didn't fucking know what he was doing with that whole sentence at all. Uh, you know, it's gotten into sort of darker parts one, and, and Sora does look very like young and childish. Oh, and as again. that series has grown, like it has gotten to sort of you know, as the fans have obviously gotten ten years older. Right. Um, See, he says. He starts talking about Sora talk, being childish, and then he goes on saying, the fans have grown 10 years older. Yes, we've grown 10 years older, but Sora hasn't aged 10 years. We've been waiting for the game. <sighs> and it hasn't even... Okay, it's been... What, 2002, 2000, almost 16 now? Yeah, it's been over 10 years. It's almost been 15, at least. Not even 15, it's almost been 13, 12. Uh, you know, it's gotten into sort of darker, more mature themes, but that original one was really sort of a nice, uh, like, wholesome trek through all of these cool, iconic worlds that we never, no game, you know, it's before Disney Infinity, and so no game was really like this celebration of everything Disney as a whole. Like we had some of those platformers in the 16-bit generation like Mickey Mania and Magical yeah. Quest. But those are just Disney it, games, right? Yeah, yeah. Those, and, and, and whereas this was just like this, like you're going to go to all these, you're gonna have the Peter Pan world and Agrabah yep. and, and the Lion yeah. King level and... Uh, Lion King level? Pride Lands didn't show up until Kingdom Hearts 2. And it hasn't been on any of them since Kingdom Hearts 2. So, where's the Lion King level at in Kingdom Hearts 1? Because I really want to see it. Oh, wait, that's right. It's not on there. Yeah, and it's, you know, the, the say what you will about some of the weird offshoots and their weird names, but the core two games have, you know, withstood the test of time, and they've just had HD collections come out recently, and yeah. people love them, and God, Kingdom Hearts 3 is one of the most anticipated games on IGN. Mm -hmm. I can't yeah. wait for Most anticipated games at IGN. It has been the most anticipated game since Kingdom Hearts 2 ended. Since everyone beat Kingdom Hearts 2. Everyone thought Birth by Sleep was Kingdom Hearts 3. And you guys are just going to rip it a sh rip it to shit again. I don't think anybody at IGN should 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 cover it. IGN, get the fuck out of this world. Go die in a hole.
Or at some so like, next year, two years? Oh, uh, like uh, never. Yeah, never. <laughs> never. During that's the, year, the one. That's during the year that future of. Battlefield takes <laughs> place. <laughs> oh, good. Yeah, I don't know that trailer at E3 was, it was wild. Awesome. It was yeah. yeah, and then the reaction it got was. Yeah, huge. Oh, man. I mean, it looked great, but like also like who knows when we'll see it. It was, it was wild. Awesome. It was yeah. yeah, and then the reaction it got was. Huge. Yeah, oh, man. I mean, it looked great, but like also like who knows when we'll see anything out of that. We'll be when we see that next Zelda? tomorrow. Oh, okay, cool. They're coming in. Yeah, great. Yeah, today we have Disney Infinity. So we're used to more used to seeing Disney characters hang out with all these other properties. Yeah, I think, yeah. but I think back yeah. then it was just so weird to yeah. see like Final Fantasy characters with Disney characters. Well, because yeah. it was kind of before we saw like the merging of even one. I'm pretty sure we saw a lot of superheroes with other superheroes. Justice League, Batman and Superman. Yeah, they're both DC, but their universes still crossed over each other's. It wasn't really weird to see it. It was pretty exciting to fucking see it. And see it happen in 2002. Brand with other stuff. Like, I mean, yeah. you know, now we see Marvel crossing over with everything. I don't even know, was it Square or Square Enix in 2002? Squaresoft. I think it was they, just Square. I think yeah. it was pre-Enix. 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 Pre-Enix and post -Nix. Yeah. That's pretty good. <laughs> uh, as the story goes, Square wanted to make something like Mario 64, yeah. but were afraid that only Disney characters could rival the appeal of Mario. So they started neg negotiations hmm. with Disney, ended up with Kingdom Hearts. I don't remember him wanting to rival with, Nintendo, with Mario 64. Because Mar I'm pretty sure PlayStation 2 wasn't around when Mario 64 came out. Because I'm pretty sure I had a PlayStation 1 and a Nintendo 64. And now a PlayStation 2. So... Where's, where's my Kingdom Hearts for PlayStation 1? There's not one, you fuck nuts. But of course, it's not anything like Mario 64. No. It's just a Final Fantasy game yeah. with Disney characters. I don't know if I'd want to see Square trying to make a Mario 64 yeah. clone. I mean, I, sat, I, I interviewed uh, Tetsuya Nomura a year or two ago, and I think I asked him about uh, sort of like what his, it was on a Mario anniversary, and sort of asked him about like what his thoughts were on the Mario series, and he said like in his lifetime of making games, seeing Mario 64 for the first time was the moment where he was like, all right, we gotta start rethinking things because this is just this is totally blew my mind. They're totally doing something different, and yeah. he did say like Mario sixty four was in his head during uh, the designing of Kingdom Hearts as something like you want to sort of like a, a pinnacle you want to reach, and not you know obviously it's not a three D platformer, but in terms of how do you create an interesting something so visually 3D world? Yeah, Kingdom Hearts was a three D platform and an action adventure game with an RPG. Mario 64 was a 3D game that was a platformer and an adventure game. So, why are you so stupid? Stimulating. I don't see how it could be inspired by Mario because jumping is Sora sucks. I can tell every time it's like the Tarzan levels. <laughs> Like falling. I was like, come on! He's got such big shoes, too. Alright. I gotta say, this isn't the Tarzan level. This is not the Tarzan level. Oh. And theirs doesn't go that far at all. I don't even think Soros has gotten that close to it because there is probably ended here and here and Soros would probably end right about there so why are you using cheats if you are going to play the game play it right no cheats no glitching Nothing.
just the game itself. Just the fucking game itself if you're going to play a fucking game. Quit using these cheats. Quit using glitches. Is that how jumping how works? Play the you game. Jump higher, yeah. jump higher with big shoes? You want to say about big shoes? So. Yeah, they're full of springs. Big shoes, you don't so. jump as well. Yeah. Yeah, I got us out of there. Don't worry. <laughs> Do you know where the kingdom comes in the title Kingdom Hearts? Huh. From Disney's Animal Kingdom theme park. No. No, it does not come from the Animal Kingdom theme park from Disney. It... It does not. Oh. oh. Interesting. Well, Animal Kingdom Wait, Hearts, did, it, is that, did that open version. the same year that this that it released? No, but like, they're the, fans of the theme park and like making this Disney so game. That and was where they, oh. in oh, but that's the, interesting. Uh, where does the hearts part come from? Oh, because it's uh, I don't the have, heart, yeah, heart theme of the game. Okay. Yeah. There. No. Yeah. That that kinda, that. I'm not going to lie, that kind of sours same. me. Why? Because, I don't know, I feel like that's just such a like, blatant product tie. It's like in Wayne's World where it's like, Pepsi. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, it, it, it bugs me. I, I think, think it's more innocent. It's, it's Japanese developers who are fans of all things Disney just wanting and to... And like, like, hey, this is right. a name of convention that works. <laughs> yeah. Fair yeah. enough. All right, if, they, if they're just, you know, earnest fans of, of the so. series, as long as it wasn't Disney being like, hey, we got this park opening, I don't you think should totally was, open. Well, you should totally need to get this. You're this close to striking it from the history of awesome? Yes. Switch it to... Let's go to the history of awesome. I will turn this couch around. Fuck you, IGN. You are so. You guys are so fucking ignorant. I swear. Well, I did the best I could to rip that whole video apart. I will leave the link if you want to watch it down in the description below. Oh my god. Tell me what you guys think. This is... Why do they gotta do this? Like, just think. So many people used to look up to them for video game stuff, and now people are just getting pissed off at them. Especially me. Especially me. I fucking hate you, IGN. I hope you die. Well, anyways, ladies, gentlemen, fellow demon slayers, I will be going. I'm gonna go ahead and tra convert this and upload it, and I will see you guys in the episode and games that I am recording for these next three freaking these next few months because. There is, I've got work, so I can't really play, download, do all this, and up, well, play video game, convert it, upload it, all in one night, so I got to build up months and months of videos before I put them out, uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys later, um, I'm, I'm just gonna go.